Hey folks, it's JP here, and I have a queen in my queen catcher right here. I've had a few people asking me lately on YouTube, how do you release the queen? How do you, how do you go about doing it? So I, I thought I'd just make a, a short little video, okay, demonstrating exactly what I do. I know you all often hear me say, I cage the queens, and then usually after three or four days I release it. So let me just go over exactly what I do after I catch the queen okay once we catch her I'll place her in the setup usually I'll put a rubber band or two on a frame and I'll secure the queen catcher at the bottom of that frame I'll place that frame inside of the hive so when I transfer the bees to the new setup she's caged I leave her caged in the setup for about three days now after you transport the hive it's always a good idea to pull the top check your frames make sure that it come apart you want to push any frames that came apart together. You always want to observe proper bee space or the bees will build wonky comb in that extra space and you don't want that because it makes your uh, inspection job that much more difficult down the road. So you check your frames, push any that came apart together, make sure they're all touching and put your top back on and gauge their progress over the next say three, four days. So now it's time to release your queen, okay? So now you've taken her out of the setup. So what I'll do is I'll go in, I'll take her out of the setup, I'll put the frames back in, any that I took out to get to her, put the top cover back on. Now let me demonstrate to you what I do next. There she is, a beauty. So now what I like to do is with the setup closed, okay, I'll take the catcher and I'll place it right up against the opening, all right? And there's a reason I do this. So I have tried releasing them on top of the frames before, and that usually works, okay? But she may decide to fly off. She usually will come back to the setup, but you may you may wind up losing her and, and losing those bees. What we're gonna do is we'll release her right up against the entrance, and uh, there's a couple of frames drawn out. It wasn't a big swarm. But uh, they've been building and uh, they're in production mode. So we're going to go ahead and release her. She should run right in. So we're going to go ahead and just uh, release her and let her run in. Okay, right against this entrance. It's about as fail proof of a way to release the queens as any I've run across. So here we go. We watch her run right in. Oh, and that's it. Okay, you just kind of shake the rest of the bees off. So we can do the same thing with these queen cages. Go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> That's all there is to it, folks. So, hope that helps.